All right. Oh, there goes another fleeing chipmunk. Man, that chipmunk was booking. So having passed the canoe launch, oh look, this is a remnant of an old chestnut tree. Yeah, what happened was after they were wiped out by blight, they still persist because the roots didn't die, right. but they never get much bigger than that. Oh, they just keep... They surrounding an old stump. Yeah. Hey. And now we're starting to figure out ways to breed ones that are resistant to the blight anyway, so they'll maybe what come back. <laughs> Not a different species. Yeah. Wouldn't be the same. They're pretty damn close. I mean, the chestnuts on the open fly and all that. As a kid, though, we had horse chestnuts. Yes. And those you use them for concrete. Yeah. You just take a big nut out of the middle and you dry it and bore a hole in the middle and you put a string through it. <laughs> Not on the end. And then you swing at each other's concrete. I see. Some kids had concrete that were. This is the cooler side of the property. You always find these hemlocks growing in the shadier northern face, cool sides of slope areas. So we're probably going to be coming to the bluffs soon. Mosquitoes are very apt. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> well, you guys are using the D, so they like me. Oh, no doubt. It's not a straight carbon dioxide thing. No, it's... People that drink beer, they find out they attract mosquitoes very much. They're attracted to beer sweat. As well as the CO2 out of your mouth. A climb awaits us as we now get closer to the bluffs. Oh, here it is. It's kind of a switchback type of ascent. Right on the Gablazer, look. I know. Yeah, and we go up here. Oh yeah, here we go. 
Yeah, there's the 18 you were looking at. Hey, 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 steep edge and wet and narrow trail. Yeah, that was good. Yeah, this is the counterpart answering bit of bluffs to the stuff that we visited in late May, which is on the other side of the river. That goes back to Newburyport, and this heads off to Duxbury. Well, we're pretty close to the top of this thing. It's a lace work of various trails. Yeah, there's lots of overlooks here. This will be perfect after the advent of cold weather wipes a bunch of the mosquitoes out. Figure like October. But we're being intrepid and providing you with a sense of it all in a time of year when the skeeters are completely insufferable. Although now that we've gained some in elevation, they seem to be fading a bit. Woodpecker species. Oh, there's a yellow trail junction heading off to explore the interior sections of the property. The midsummer cicada buzz. Ooh. Here's an overlook. 